Robin, our first robot, and the robot comes with three components. You have the surgeon console, where the surgeon actually performs the procedure, the patient tower, which allows us to plug in our instruments and do the surgery while we work on the field, and the robot itself, which has four arms and recording instruments and allows us to do the surgery. The bed that we use is hooked up to the robot itself, so in that way if you need to position the patient or move the table in any way, it all works together so we don't have to worry about how the instruments are going to interact with the patient tissue. Then we're, where are we going now, Ruby? So now we're going to our second robot room, which is room four. This is where Batman is. Hi, Joey. Welcome, welcome, welcome. All right, so first and foremost, when you're going to drape the robot, you need to be double gloved because there's a very high chance that your hand is going to hit a non-scale surface on the robot. So we're just going to move along very quickly right now. Now you take the top end, you hold here at the end, Take all the equipment at the top here, and you just quickly roll this down here. You don't have to reach all the way up here. So you just feed, feed, feed. Pop this on, it's gonna make a noise, just like that. You know that's good. Pop that on. You pop that on. One thing you can do is you can look at the monitor over there, and when that turns blue, it tells you that that arm is great. And then I go to the other side here. Again, this is a sterile technique thing where I'm not touching one next to the other. Feed, 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 leave it there. There's the noise. That's locked on. And then just keep progressing. Doesn't matter which one you go to now. I try to stay away from the non-sterile area. You can grab this with it under the drape and move over. Keep in mind that this bottom piece right here can pop off pretty easily, so you gotta be kind of tender with it. If that happens, just have somebody pull the drape off and give you a new drape. <laughs> 